What is up my good people? The name is Pixel Love and we are back again with another episode of Earthbound. In the last episode, we got ki basically kicked out of the city of Foresight. Fucking Pokey was there, Monotoil, all kind of BS and whatnot. And I ended up here in this gold mine back in the desert. So, that's what we're actually going to be doing today. We are going to be exploring this desert. And I was told that this is one of the hardest dungeons in the entire game. But you know what? I'm not going to prepare at all. Because A, I never prepare. And B, I feel like I'm pretty stacked. Almost all my folks are above uh, level... Or they're almost all level 40. So, you know, I have nothing to worry about. It's not going to be that difficult. I doubt it. I have faith in these kids. What I don't have faith is in this filter that I just uh, put on for my mic. I didn't have any problem digging until this. I found a maze. Lots of monsters appeared, so I couldn't proceed. There's five big moles. If I beat the monsters, I can continue on. I think I have a bleeding ulcer for marrying too much. I'm helpless to really do anything. Oh, poor guy. Anyways, this is what we're going to be doing. We're going to be taking care of all these enemies over here. What the fuck? Have I not already beaten these guys back in, like, Annette? Oh, I guess I clearly haven't because they have a hell of a lot more bigger HP than I thought they would. Anyways, as I was mentioning before, I'm still a little concerned about my mic and whatnot. Mostly because I've been messing around with some filters around OBS and... I, I'm trying new things. I'm trying like noise gate, noise suppression and whatnot. And I really haven't had much time to fiddle around with it. It's not because I don't have any time. It's just because like I don't know what would be the best way for me to test these things out. So I'm going to just try and test it on a live video. So hopefully the audio doesn't fuck up. If it does, you know the reason why. And I absolutely apologize if for whatever reason my words just get cut out for whatever God knows reasons. Which... Hopefully it shouldn't. On the bright side, however, I shouldn't be able to hear the squeaking of my chair. And if I end up hearing the squeaking of my chair more throughout the, throughout editing and whatnot, I'm going to lose it. Because that's the whole reason why I did this. So I won't have to hear the squeaking of my chair, the clicking of my mouse, or even the typing of my keyboards. Because let me tell you. It gets annoying <laughs> listening and then having to edit it out afterwards. It gets annoying really quickly. In other news, hello, what is this? I am one of the masters of this hole. There are five masters and alls. We are all moles, of course. I believe I am the third strongest among us. I know he says amongst us, but still. It's he, he said among us. Number three. Okay. I have a big number three over there. Uh, Let's see here. What can we do? What can we do? Oh, Lord. Uh, You know what? I'm feeling ballsy. Let's try a PSI freeze beta. Oh. That was quite... That was quite a big, quite a big impact. What the hell? Alright buddy, you asked for it. You asked for it. You said vulnerable to PSI flash. Well, I'm about to flash your... Actually, that doesn't really sound really great at all. To be honest. Whatever. PSI freeze beta. You can never go wrong with it. As I just showed you. <laughs> Bye bye number three. You were clearly the most mid out of everyone. IQ capsule. That's poggers, bro. Let's use it on Jeff right away. Oh, we always gotta give the IQ capsules to Jeff. He needs his IQ up. Alright, I have no clue where I'm gonna go next. All I just know is that there's a goddamn maze and I'm walking through it. Surprised I haven't seen that many enemies around, only the snakes. And just as I said that, here's a snake! 
Oh, well, would you look at that? I'm back to where I started. Let's go. I love being lost in this maze. What the hell? Also, I just realized it probably would be a better idea if I just lowered down the volume on mic because I am a little, just a little bit more closer than usual. But I'll just check. I'll just check it during record uh, during editing. Everything that I always change, everything that I, oh, that I try to make better and whatnot, I usually just have to be like, yeah, it's happened in this episode, but I'm not going to re-record it for obvious reasons. A big bottle rocket. Ah, yes, I forgot. I have all these bottle rockets for Jeff, and I still haven't used a single one of them. Speaking of which, I'm going to just give this to Jeff right now. You know what, the next time I see one of those big guardian diggers or whatnot, I'm gonna just fire off a ball rocket just to see how much damage we got. So, wow. What is this? Ooh, did I get to come along too? You take my sungle on, you may look like a regular small mouse, and lead you to an exit if you're lost in a maze. Can I leave you with my son? <laughs> oh no, I actually do have this other one. I have, a, I have a son, but it's in the Escargo Express. Oh no! <laughs> Shoot! What did I just see up there? Uh. Okay. Take him out right away. Uh, sure. I guess I'll use a PSI fire. Why not? Takes out everyone. I'm more concerned about that ant. Looks like he packs a punch. Uh, can we kill it? Kill it? Thank you very much, thank you very much. Wasn't that bad. It wasn't that bad. I'm more concerned about how many of these guys are here. Four of them. Uh, let's see here. Let's do one of these, and I'll do one of these. I could also do another one of these, I guess. I just want all these guys to be gone. Out of here, finito. I don't want to see them. There's way too many of them. Let's rock their world, why don't we? And they didn't die. Oh, was it so hard that I just wanted to try to save my PSI? Was that so hard for me to do? Alright, let's line them up once again. They'll take the same amount of damage, whatnot, yada yada yada. Now, let's rock their world big time. That's what I like to see, baby! That's what I like to see, that's the damage I wanted to see, let's go! In what world did you thought it was a good idea to try using PSI Magnet on Jeff? In what world did you think that was a good idea? Literally not this one because you're dead. Okay, I'd, I'd be lying if I didn't say that the amount of PSI that I've been using so far has been pretty concerning. I don't have a lot of it. And I don't have a lot of items that can give me back my PSI, so... I guess I'll have to... What is going on with my controller? This isn't e I'm not even using the joystick, I'm just using the freaking buttons. Anyways, as I was saying, I'm just gonna keep it nice and simple for... Paula. Because I do not want the PSI to run out right away because that'll be very very harmful also shit <laughs> thanks a lot for giving me poison dickhead god damn it paula on the bright side however i do have a nice free vial of serum that i could use right away 
that I could free up my storage from. That's better. Alright, Bozo. I'm really the third strongest master. I'll destroy you now. Are, are all these guys going to say that they're number three? Really? You're all mid. That's what you are. <laughs> Why would you say you're number three? If you know that there's five people and you know that... Okay, you know what? I, I don't even know what to say to that. I don't even know if I want to use rocket. I'm going to just bash them. Actually, no, you know what? If you know you're number three and you know that there's five people, why would you want to say you're the middle one? You're actually saying that you're mid. Come on, this isn't rocket science. Also, god damn it, I forgot about the stupid power shield. God damn, why can't I use some physical attacks on this guy? And he's attacking Jeff, god damn it. Um. Paula, just use BSI Magnet. Uh, and, uh... I'm just really gonna kick my own ass for this. Uh, just shoot him, I guess, Jeff. Because we need somebody to shoot at him. So he could die. Better. So, why? Who wants to be mid? Come on, now. A coin of defense. What does it do? That's huge defense. Massive. We'll see who we'll see who needs it the most. Be right back. Why are there so many ducks? Why are there so many ducks? Oh cool, I just took them out all one by one. And take out the noose? Yeah, let's go, baby! I don't need to deal with these scrubs. They're just in my way. God damn it, I have way too much crap on me. And I realized that I didn't use my bottle rockets <laughs> during the Guardian Digger fight. God damn it! I'm gonna have to use it on this next person. But first, I gotta take out these scrubs. Just like that. Instant win, instant W. W's all around. Oh, would you look at that! My strengths fall between the second and fourth strength. Dog, why does everyone keep saying they're mid? Uh, what do we have here? What do we have? Oh, fuck. Actually, you know what? Yeah, fuck this. I don't want the bomb. I have way too much crap on me. Alright, Jeff. It's bottle rocket time. Alright, let's go. God damn it. Hey, would you look at that? The ball rocket wasn't so bad, actually. I need to use these more. I just didn't want to have the bomb anymore on my hands. And I also have a chick as well. <sighs> Fucking hell. What do I do with it? I don't want it. <laughs> a luck capsule inside. Ooh. Ooh, ooh, who needs luck the most? 9, 40, 30, oh god, Jeff. Actually, you know, I'll hold on to it just a little while. The Platinum Band. The Platinum Band's supposed to be something that I equip. By the way, I give the coin of defense to Jeff. It is, yes it is. So I finally hear that the chicken has stopped. Pin or whatnot. Can I use it? Alright, you know what? That's a W to me. That's a W to me. I already have so much crap in my inventory. I don't want this chicken anymore. I couldn't even sell it. I had nowhere to sell it to. And these bozos are gonna be dead right away. Why do we have to deal with so many of these guys? <laughs> what the hell? Um, rock your world, I suppose. I don't really care. 
Better yet, PSI Magnet. Let's see how well that goes. And no one had any psychic points. Cool. Alright, please let this wipe out everyone. There goes one Mad Duck. There goes one Noose Man. Yeah, you know what? It wasn't so bad, I guess. But still, like, why? These guys are just wasting my time. Wasting my time and my PSI. What the hell? I just want to find these Guardian Diggers who believe they're mid. God, not this again. Number three, huh? Uh, let's see here. I don't want to attack his nest. I want to use one of my ball rockets. I'm almost out of them. Cool. Oh, oh come on! How did that not? How did that not kill him? What the hell? And he was less than 18 HP. You're kidding me here, bro. Come on. Oh well. A guts capsule. Ooh, baby. I almost want to give it to the person with the most guts, which is Ness. I don't know. Jeff is really. Jeff is slacking on a lot of things, but would it be a good idea for me to use the Guts Capsule on him? I don't know, because I really, like I said before, I really want to give it to Ness. I feel like he'd use it the most. He he would be the one who would be better off with, with it, just saying. Uh, calorie Stick, give it to Jeff. Let's have everyone sauced up. And wait a minute, how much health does Ness have? Jesus Christ! This man's a hundred down. Give him a pizza. Because I do not want to use any of my PSI for healing. As I do not want to use all of it right away. And you know what? Fuck it, I'll use the Guts Capsule on Ness. He just seems like the person who would use it the most. Thank you very much, Ness. I appreciate it. I don't appreciate is how many nobodies there are over here. Dude, just look at how many of them there are! What the fuck? Jesus Christ, I'm gonna waste all my PSI just trying to take you all out. How many of these guys do they have to appear? Like you're all irrelevant! Yes, you do like about, what, 200? No, not 200. You guys do like about 20 to 30 damage against me, but still, you're all irrelevant! You're worthless! Get out of my goddamn screen! Y'all don't even have the XP to make this worth it. Holy shit! That was 600 damage right there! Damn, I should really use these big ball rockets more sparingly. I was like, eh, it's probably gonna do like, what, 200, 300 damage? 600 damage? Holy shit! I'm so sorry, ball rockets. And also, please don't tell me that Windows <laughs> notification got through. Bought the strongest master of the soul. The second strongest, the fourth strongest, and the weak. Dog, how many times are we gonna have this conversation? <laughs> you can't say you're mid like this! Oh, who thought to themselves, hey, you know what? I'm number three. <laughs> I'm the best. Ah, fuck it. This is the last one we have, I believe. Just go all out with a banger. And of course, Jeff get Jeff's the first one to attack. Instead of Paula, instead of Paula, it's both Ness and Jeff. 
Even though I thought that Paula was gonna just fucking rock his shit right away. Be just like that, but no! Jeff and Ness have to go first! Cause they wanna get hit first. That's all I see, that's all I hear. Thank you very much for the PSI caramel. Oh yes, there's a teddy bear as well. I should get this teddy bear. I believe it's almost... I believe it's almost broken though. Also a super bomb. Effect others. Gone after one. I don't know if I want to use bombs. I'm fine with bottle rockets. I'm fine with Jeff's bottle rockets. Actually, am I? Because just bottle rockets were kind of a little mid, not gonna lie. I felt like some of his shooting power was still better than the bottle rockets. Except the big bottle rockets, though, however. That was... That was something different. That was something absolutely different. Also, I feel like I am lost, so I am just going to follow whatever path leads me back to... Also, this isn't the path I just remember. This is just another way. On the bright side, it doesn't look like there's any more enemies over here. The gigantic ants weren't such a big problem. It's just the fact of how many fucking nooses and ducks there were. Like, why? They're irrelevant. <laughs> They're fucking irrelevant. They didn't do shit. They just waste my time and my resources. I don't think that's the way to go. Down here? Yes! Here we go, baby! Let's go! Ah! Oh, come on, G! Just yes, please! Leave! I don't want to see you anywhere near me again. Just want to move and get on to my next destination. Please and thank you very much. Gotten rid of the monster? Good job. Okay, from here on, just let me dig. You'll see I'll find the buried gold. Before I start digging, I'm going to set a careful plan of action. Oh, cool, cool. What, is that it? Am I just not gonna get my gold? Is that it, Mr. Minor Person? Am I just not gonna get my gold? What a travesty. What an absolute travesty. Also, 19,000. Damn, that's a lot of money in the bank! Holy shit! Hey, thanks a lot, Dad. Thanks a lot. I guess I might go to Foresight, just because you still have those contact lenses that I should really give to that person in the bakery, so... I'll see you, the city of Foresight. FUCK! Here we go. To Foresight we go! Did they even allow- <laughs> they let me- they allowed me to get on this bus with a giant ass teddy bear. I'm surprised that they didn't have to charge me another two dollars just for the teddy bear itself. Even though it's almost dead though. Which is the sad part. I don't like it when my teddy bears die. <laughs> they just... <laughs> they, did, they just turn into a pile of fluff. What? <laughs> what the hell? Hey, yo, is this the minor guy? Ness, greetings! I'm George, Gerardo Montague's brother. Is- what the- who? I'm sorry, who? <gasps> Who's that? Is that the minor guy I helped? Gerardo is in his mind. Okay, it is. But he hasn't found any buried treasure yet. We did, however, find a diamond instead. Gerardo told me to give it to Ness. Here it is, please take it. It cool, you know. I'll take it. I'll take the diamond. Is he working at the other mine? What other mine? That stupid thing with Talarama BS. That shit. Don't get me started on that. 
Anyways, we continue on with this epic bus ride. Oh, what? There's a magical butterfly there? Come on, dude! Come on! Anyways, great to be back here in the city. Actually, is it? I don't know. I wouldn't be able to tell you. All I just know is that I have a bunch of crap that I have to give to Escargo Express now. What do you mean? <laughs> what do you mean your storage lockers are full? <laughs> what? <laughs> Excuse me? Hello, Escargo Express? Yeah, I want you to pick up something. What do you mean you're full? What do I have in there? <laughs> what the hell? What do I have in there? Skip sandwich, skip sandwich, croissant, bread roll, candy, skip sandwich. Most all of this is just food. <laughs> Oh, so what? You could you, you couldn't at least you couldn't at least fill this one up. You couldn't at least fill this screen up. No, instead you're telling me that it's all full. What? That is that is some BS if I ever heard some. Well, what do I do? <laughs> I mean, I could just sell I could just sell the food items that I have in here that I don't use already. Because after all, like, that's what I usually do. That's what I typically do. I just shove all my <laughs> unwanted food items in there. God damn. How are you going to be telling me that fucking storage lockers are full? What the hell? Alright, we're here. And I need to buy another ticket. God damn it. Why do I need to buy another ticket? Here, show it. You take it from me? Okay, you did take it from me. No wonder I couldn't find an Escargo Express. Anyways, lady, manager, bitch, whatnot. Uh, I don't know if this is the same as buried gold, but you know. Does this uh diamond tickle your fancy? What? 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 I can't tell what it is from this distance. Bring it closer. Alright, you're just like that same sleazy guy. Back in Tucson. Oh, come on. Urgh! How do I get it closer to you? There we go. Yay! That, that, that diamond. You're gonna pay with that diamond? Okay, that's fine. I'll rip up this contract. Don't tell anyone about the diamond. Now the Runaway 5 are free. You should thank me. That diamond is worth maybe 50. So I gave you a bargain. Let's go, buddies! Sorry about being such troublemakers. We won't be so gullible anymore. Well, our fans are waiting, baby. Let's fucking go, baby! That's what I like to hear. Let's just do this one last show and then get out of here. Alright, thanks again. Money, that's what I want. Money, that's what is hot. Money, that's what I want. Money, it's what we ain't got. It's a freedom, freedom, freedom is what we really sought. Okay, I get it, I get it. <laughs> I had to bring him out. They're just like, alright, they get it. They get it, boys. I highly doubt that diamond is worth anything. I'm telling you, it's probably at least worth 50. Well, they are, they are here, so, you know, might as well watch another performance. Welcome to the Runaway 5 performance, welcome to the final Runaway 5 performance at the Tapala Theater. In memory of Ness! I want to hear my name, goddammit. It's going to be a great show. We're so good, it makes me think that those kids will exit <laughs> by the exit will wet their pants. Those kids are hip, baby. Oh, please never say that again.
hold up, I just realized, who the hell is her? <laughs> I'm just over here trying to charge my headphones and then I see this person come over here. <laughs> what the hell? They even brought out the bus. <laughs> they even brought out the bus, no fucking way. I feel like they might have actually left Foresight by now. They just was like, fuck this, I'm out. Yeah, you see, they're out. They're gone. They're dipping. Ah, oh, you're a friend of the Runaway Five. I'm gonna see Miss Venus. And Sayed, quickly, don't let the other fans see you enter. Wait a minute, I've heard about this person before. Miss Venus. I don't remember where I heard it from. It was like... What was it? Was it the happy, happy village that I heard about her? Oh, you're just a little kid. I'm too busy right now to give you my autograph. Maybe next time, little man. Jeez. Really? You're just, you're just gonna leave it out like that, alright. Also, I may have had to <laughs> reset that voice line just because I thought that my mic would have probably not picked it up. By the way, I'm surprised that for the most part, it looks like my mic has picked up everything. But I still have yet to check it in, uh, whatchamacallit, it? editing. Yeah, that one. If it ends up being horrible in editing, I'm so sorry. Oh, I can't see the Runaway 5 here anymore. I should dump this sorry excuse of a man and become a Runaway 5 groupie. God damn. I heard Venus made an appearance at the Runaway 5 show. I missed her because I went to the bathroom. I'll hate bathrooms for the rest of my life. Dog, that sucks. That sucks. Oh, hi. Man, I feel bad for you. Well, that's pretty much it to the extent of what I can do. So I'm going to just head back to the hotel, call it a day, and, well, shit, I'm in the wrong spot. Anyways, if you liked the video, leave a like, comment, and subscribe. My name is Pixel Love, Memento Mori and whatnot, and I will see you guys in the next episode. Take care, everybody.